Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today in this section, I am going to explain how to post a asset sale uh, to asset sale to customer with the revenue. Uh, so for this transaction code, but for this transaction, uh, we have to use a transaction code F-92 in SAP. So I will show you the step-by-step -step process for this posting. So in the command field, I am entering the transaction code as F-92. And then I am selecting the document date as same date and uh, document type would be DR and posting period is uh, 11 and company, my company code is 2000 and currency is INR and then I will be mentioning some document uh, header text as a uh, set sales with revenue and then my first line item the posting key would be 01 and 01 means uh, customer debit and I'm taking the customer here and then okay so before entering the amount i want to show you the the asset uh, explorer in that asset explorer i will show you the asset or what is the acquisition value and what is the depreciation posted is there any uh, unplanned depreciation pushing you can see the net book value everything there is zero one and Okay, now my asset would be 500003 and here you can see the planned values and the asset equation value is 1 lakh and the order depreciation has a, a planned 10,000 and unplanned has been planned 20,000. So if you, okay, come down here, uh, your netbook value is showing as, uh, showing as 69,999. Okay, I will consider this one, posted values. So here if you can see the posted values, equation value is 1000 same and unplanned depreciation is same and but the order depreciation is showing as 9000 uh, because here we are in currently in 11th period so till 11th, 11th period depreciation has been executed uh, for the period 12 we have not, not been executed so that's why the differences are coming here now the net book value if you can see 70,832 now uh, I'm posting the transaction transaction is asset sale to customer with revenue so I will be selling this asset for 80,000 okay so I'm going back to the F-92 screen here I'm entering the amount as 80,000 and then I will be mentioning some text as asset sale with customer the asset number is to customer and the asset number would be 500003 and then here I need if we need to select the posting key as a 50 and the GL account would be set the GL account we need to select I'm selecting this GL account and then hit enter and again the amount and the text would be copied from the here um, I can enter field okay set retirement and then hit enter uh, now system is looking for the commitment item and here yeah okay okay now system has thrown one pop-up box so it's relating to uh, asset so here we need to give the asset number which we are going to retain sell with the customer so here in my case the asset would be 500003 okay and then asset value date would be same as the posting date and here we have two options if you are going to retire this asset or sell this asset completely so we need to select the complete retirement if it is partially then we need to select the partial in my case i would be selecting the i would be selling this asset completely so i have selected this complete retirement and then I'm selecting this continue and then uh, click on document and click on simulate here so the final entry would be this one customer debit and uh, profit and sale of asset would be credit 
this is the final entry if you can see in the simulate in asset accounting level so here we can see the let me put the GL account description here change layout Okay, it seems it's not there okay let it be so here okay so account receivable so so customer debit would be 80,000 and then this asset credit asset credit means uh, 1 lakh is credited to asset and then the profit of sale uh, again it's a credited to the GL account profit of sale, sale of asset account ID and then here this one is a uh, depreciation till we have posted uh, this many this much depreciation and this is our unplanned depreciation and uh, and then profit and sale of asset would be 40 debit and uh, profit and sale of asset would be 9000 this is a uh, uh, we are getting the revenue this is the revenue which we are getting by selling this asset and then come one step back here and uh, click on post so you can see here document has been posted in company code 2000 now I'm going here and display asset accounting so this is the entry system has generated two entries uh, in the FI books this is the entry this and this is the document number uh, here you can see the customer debit and the sale of profit and, uh, profit and sale of asset uh, would be credit in the asset accounting side this is the document number which has been generated and here we can see the asset asset account is uh, created and the depreciation account debit and uh, unplanned depreciation account debit and then Profit and sale of asset uh, debit and the same GL account again create with uh, the revenue revenue amount. So this is the entry. Okay, so and one more step back here. So this is, and I will be going back to the asset explorer. Uh, here we can uh, refresh here so here we can see the posted values so net book value is showing as zero so this asset has been write off completely without So here we can see so that's all in this section thank you so much for watching my videos